Scientific studies of the ocean are important, but obtaining data can present many challenges. Ocean Networks Canada use innovative infrastructure and technology to collect a wide range of data, helping communities, governments and industry make informed decisions about our future. We went to find out more. Ocean Networks Canada is an initiative of the University of Victoria that operates the world's largest network of cabled sensors off the west and east coast of Canada and in the Arctic. The open data is available in real time to anyone anywhere in the world. We're all about scientific research as the foundation of what we do and that scientific research is also then used to develop data products and services that provide information for people and the public and governments and industry so that everyone who work in the ocean and do things in the ocean can actually do it sustainably and safely. So the beauty of the infrastructure is we've essentially put a, a network, an internet-based network on the deep sea floor. Uh, and what that provides is high bandwidth communication, gigabit ethernet capability, and kilowatts of power. So it's not an oceanographic instrument with a small battery, it's eight to 10 kilowatts of power available for the science user. So it's really only limited by someone's imagination. Ocean Network has this uh, fantastic infrastructure in the sea uh, and also deep in the ocean. And so what we try and what we hope together is to be able to realize that original dream, to really use the ocean as a gigantic neutrino telescope and allow basically together with the rest of the community to fully open neutrino astronomy and discover many more sources in the universe and understand a little bit more, just a little bit more of our universe. We are very excited to be part of a partnership with the physicists to um, install this neutrino observatory. And the reason they came to us is because we know how to operate systems in, in the ocean very, very well. In addition to deep sea cabled infrastructure that provides data for scientific research, Ocean Networks Canada is developing a growing suite of ocean intelligence products and services that provide ocean intelligence. Coming up, coming up. Ocean intelligence really encompasses many aspects of our understanding of the ocean and how it relates to people's lives, and government decision makers for that matter. It comprises information that scientists use to make discoveries and to understand the ocean, especially as it's being impacted by climate change. But also we take data from oceanographic data, combine it with data models and other data types, and we develop data products that then are used to protect people's lives and, and protect safety. And that's really what ocean intelligence is about. And so, for example, we combine data and different kind of models to provide information about how high a tsunami wave is going to impact a coastal community. And the emergency managers use that data to make plans decide where caches go, food caches and supplies go, what roads will be closed so they can, they can have uh, appropriate evacuation, and then in the future, where they want to build their schools and make those kinds of decisions. You bring your idea to us, uh, be it an oceanographic instrument, uh, the, the precursor to a neutrino telescope, an earth-shaking early warning sensor, and we have the capability and the engineering skills to take that take your idea, put it into concrete form, and then deploy it in the deep ocean. 